Hey, how's everybody doing today? I'm doing all right. Thank you for asking. I'm just now getting started on my working outs and stuff and it's going on 2 p.m. It's sunny, pretty cloudy. Pretty cloudy, but it's hot, humid. Hot and humid. <sighs> My back still ain't doing great. Pretty much just been laying in bed most of the day. Sleeping and just laying there and just trying to make it through the day again. I really am just now getting started. Uh, kind of slow on the go. And uh, sorry I haven't really put out any videos in a couple days. Number one, my back. Number two, you know, sometimes you're not inspired. Uh, to do a whole lot and that's kind of where I'm at right now I'm just kind of you know kind of in the middle of nothing on my other channel old mental pickle o-l-d-m-e-n-t-a-l first word pickle is the last word that's where I live stream video games and I did do some of that over the past couple days you know doing that doesn't take a whole lot of effort or creativity just more you know it's easy to do and if people want to join in and look and chat and stuff while I'm doing it then that's fine So I've been trying to keep active through this, you know, back issue. This is nothing new, guys. I've been going through this for 25 years, so I don't make it any easier necessarily. But you do get used to it as far as just the inconvenience of it. But I think I missed Wednesday, maybe. I think I missed Wednesday. Uh, I didn't walk or spin on the bike or lift weights or anything. I think it was Wednesday. And uh, Thursday and Friday I went ahead and managed to, somehow to go ahead and, you know, get my stuff done and of course I'm just now starting today but I'll get it done today I'm at the point right now where it really just needs that one deep pop that a good chiropractor can give me and I think I'd get some comfort pretty quick but we're broke as all heck right now. My wife, I love her to death, but she loans people our money and and puts us in a hurting. 
and then add on top of that my chiropractor don't take our insurance that we have so I have to pay the $40 and we don't have it you know I'm all for helping people but you know it's like I tell her you know you got to think you can't put yourself in a bind by helping people I always tell her you know what if something goes wrong and we need some money what if we need uh, you know new battery on the car and new tires the hot water heater goes out the stove goes out what if I need to go to the chiropractor <laughs> you know then we don't have the money so you got to think of that kind of stuff we're not rich or nothing we live check to check just like all the other poor people finally make it as slow as I am to the back part of our neighborhood <laughs> and my son calls <laughs> he just pulled up at the house he says he has me a gift <sighs> he said that before he came over I'm like did you get me a new back <sighs> that would be a dream a new back <sighs> so let me get up back to the house and see what he's got for me. There's my bus way over there. Well, what'd you get me that for? Huh? What'd you get me that for? Well, because I told Brandon and Jordan I want to play Back for Blood said that you were typing on Facebook and that was kind of lame so <laughs> I went and got you a $20 headset. Well, it's I, Turtle Beach so it's got a uh, it's good quality it's what I got at home. I appreciate it. You gotta play. I've got like two more pair of these. Do you? <laughs> they said you didn't have a mic. Yeah Jordan even gave me a pair. Why aren't you using it dink bat? Remember, I got Discord downloaded, and I was going to do all that, but no one wanted to play nothing with me, so... They said you were playing last night. Well, yeah. But I never can get you guys to play nothing with me. So I never used anything. Plug it in. <laughs> and let's play. I'm home bored. you got to get on. I'm You're bored. sick. I'm quarantining in my car. Well, I appreciate it. <coughs> Love you. you gotta get on. <laughs> I will later. I still got to keep going here and spin and work out. All right. Bye. My goofy son. I appreciate the thought. He don't usually spend money on me. And he don't need to. You don't need to if you're watching this video. But spending money. I got two types of these already. Or microphones. Now I got three. Let's continue our walk. And if you watch this, you're supposed to be quarantined. You're a disease. Now I probably got it. But I will try them on. I will test them out. Why not?
So, just a little recap for people that don't watch all my videos, especially my vlog type stuff. And, you know, I've talked about it in my cycling videos and other type videos as well, but maybe you missed out. I have a bad back. I hurt my back when I was 25. And every day in my life since then, I've either been uncomfortable or bedridden. You know, from one degree to the other at some 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 point life has not been easy although I've had some enjoyment when you hurt 24 hours a day seven days a week 365 days a year etc etc you know there's a difference in chronic back pain and waking up and maybe just having a stiff back or something and then you're okay for the next 10 years. Chronic back pain is just terrible. It ruins your life. It ruins you as a person. And uh, nobody out there seems to grasp it unless you've been through it you know it's a horrible it's a horrible injury to have and I've had great days since then as far as you know able to do stuff but that don't mean that I don't have discomfort and also, you know, knowing my limitations. Because anything from grabbing something off the top of your desk, just reaching down, grabbing your keys or your phone, can uh, throw your back out. A movement, something so simple, can destroy your whole day. I'm looking into finding a different chiropractor. One that does the ring dinger, as they call it. Some of them call it the Y strap. Basically, you're getting, they put you on a table, wrap a towel around underneath your chin, or they use a strap that straps around your head and they pull. They lock your pelvis in so nothing can move. They lock you down. So the only thing that moves is from the waist up. And it pulls your spine all the way down to your butt bone. And pretty much ever since I hurt my back 25 years ago, that's how I felt like I needed. I've even mentioned it. Like I feel like I need to be ripped apart. So, I'm trying to find someone around my area that does that. But most chiropractors are not trained in that. The guy that I watch most of the time do that is from Houston, Texas. And uh, I have a feeling that that would, after 25 years of feeling like this, I have a feeling that it would almost heal me I just I just have a feeling so eventually I'm either gonna have to take a vacation and go there for a few days and uh, or I'm gonna have to find someone around my area within a couple of hours away that'll do it Anyway, back here in the back end of the neighborhood, I'll be turning around here in just a minute and heading home, and then I'm going to jump on the bike and spin. Uh, 
and then I still have to get in a full body workout. Lightweight, high rep. I think one of the culprits right now is my weight bench. I think it's too tall. And I think when I go to sit down, uh, I think whenever I lay back and do a flat bench uh, with the dumbbells, I think it's actually stretching my legs out and my back out too far because it's so high. And uh, I think that's putting pressure on my back. I think that's uh, I think that's triggering it. So I'm either gonna have to get a new bench that's lower to the ground, or I'm gonna have to build some kind of a platform for my feet to sit on that kind of goes around, you know, the bench so I can get in there. So. Let's get home, guys. Well, here I am, guys. Just now got on the bike. It's been spinning for about a minute now. If you want to know my setup, I got this. And I'll let that hold my phone so I can watch some videos. Who am I watching? Stripped. Putting the same decal there. Wanna ride bike. Well, well, well. Get rid of the group shifts. Well, well, well. He's been on here since he bought it. I support everyone I'm subscribed to. Every video that every channel puts out I'm subscribed to, I watch. From the time I subscribe to them till the time I decide to unsubscribe. And most times I also go back and look at their old videos before I subscribed. So I'm a good subscriber. So that's my little setup I use whenever I'm out here on my bike. Got the water. Nothing spectacular, nothing amazing like some people have, but that's what I got. And it works well enough. If you keep up with my videos, you know why I'm doing this now instead of cycling. <gasps> what? I stopped cycling? Yeah. It's been about a month now. I got tired of feeling in danger out here on my very first road that I get on whenever I take off. So, five and a half years of cycling, I finally decided to be done. Now, that don't mean I'm not going to pack the bike up. Maybe go somewhere like a bike-friendly trail. You know, walkers, joggers, cyclists. A nice scenic trail or something like that, you know. That don't mean I'll never do something like that. It just means for my daily exercise, I'm done. So, I do this every day now for 30 minutes. Uh, I'm not getting quite the workout that I got while actually cycling and I'm not going for as long a time My bike rides always lasted like an hour, maybe an hour and a half and uh, Definitely a whole lot more difficult Cycling than it is spinning just like this I figure I figure I'm going a good five miles in 30 minutes. I don't know So I'm getting a sweat on, burning calories, 
and being active and all that while my back is being screwy so I feel like I'm winning regardless anyway Robert your videos over I'm gonna find another video to watch you owe me some watch time watch all my videos all of them all of them all right I gotta do this and then I gotta do a full body workout at some point today so see you in a little <clears throat> We're almost there, guys. Seems like I'm going double, uh, double time. done let's be done <laughs>